Welcome to Berlin. We are here to explore, to see what cool stuff we can find. Berlin is a city for creative people and there's a lot of cool stuff going on here. Last night we were at an open midnight for electronic music. My friend Elias Bakken and I had been invited by Helen Lee and Drew Fustini. Helm had made her own instruments with electronics and was one of the artists performing. Helm and Drew both love electronics, just like Elias and I. So after the show, the four of us went out for a kebab and we geeked out talking about electronics the rest of the night. What's gonna happen now? Now we're gonna go over to uh, Drew and Helen's house to do some hacking. Helen Lee, the author of The Crafty Kid's Guide to DIY Electronics. She invited us to her kitchen lab to teach us about craft-based electronics. So there's no soldering, no wiring in the whole book. So this is um, from my book, Crafty Electronics for Kids, um, and it's a sewable circuitry um, project, and it's called the BFF gloves. So basically you have two sets of gloves, one for you and one for your BFF. <laughs> And the circuit is designed so when you hold hands, let me come over to this side, when you hold hands, the heart lights up. Oh, uh, nice! <laughs> the cool thing about circuitry, the sewable circuitry, so you can go up and down or you can just take it on a path, it doesn't really matter. These boards, are, is it something you make or you this, buy them? Or? This is an embroidery hoop. Oh, <laughs> dude, even I knew that. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you can make any ordinary electronic component sewable just with a pair of pliers. Um, what you do is you take the legs in the pliers and then you roll it around and you've got a nice sewable resistor. Actually it's really cheap um, to get started in uh, craft based electronics. All you need is a roll of copper tape and some paper and some LEDs to uh -huh. do some paper circuitry. Or um, to get started with sewable circuitry you just need a roll of thread, um, conductor thread, which mm -hmm. you can get from Adafruit. Okay. Uh, they're probably the best supplier. Inspired by Helen's crafty circuits, I'm now going to buy myself some conductive thread and see if I can make some kind of cool crafty circuit. Mm -hmm. 